to all you mini one owners I haven't forgotten about you okay so as you're probably aware I now on the channel have a DJI Mini 2 but that doesn't mean I've stopped testing and stopped playing around with the Mini 1 far from it so what I want to talk about today is a new type of range extender um, I'm not aware of anyone in the UK that are doing this um, this was recommended to me by a particular youtuber so Carlos if you're watching thank you very much for the tip so I have had these new ones made and cut on sorry short I'm going to be stocking them myself um, so obviously for details I'm not ordering them obviously it will be in the description below so Let's take a look at them and I will show you what we're going to be testing them against on this video. Right, so on this channel you have seen the particular ones that have always won. Obviously, as you know, I have tested stock controllers, I've tested parabolic reflectors, I've tested Yagis, tested different metals within the Yagis, so copper, brass or aluminium. Um, the copper one, by the way, they give you the best, best range. But up until now, by far the best uh, range extender that I've ever found are these para Yagis okay and um, you may have seen these before um and you may have seen that i tested these against the ocusync 2.0 on the mini 2 um and the parayag is basically we on the mini one gave a longer signal and a better better range basically than what ocusync did on the mini 2 but there is a new contender so let's look at that now so once again thank you to carlos for suggesting these to me so these are the new 2.4 gigahertz long range yagis Okay, so these are obviously are designed to be used in non-urban environments. I do have uh, the 5.8 gigahertz set, uh, which I will be testing, all right? And um, obviously this is as fair a video as you can possibly get. So like I said, I'm gonna be stocking these. Now, as you know, the Pariagis are sold by Pete Flower. His details will be in the description below as well. It makes no difference to me which one you buy okay i don't care this is just a fair test so what i'm going to do is like i say these are the new ones so i have already been out and i've already tested these and i tested them against stock controller and i tested them against the parayagis because that was a known quantity so what i'm going to do is i'm going to roll that video you can see for yourself then we'll pick it up at the end right guys so this is actually a dual purpose video um so what i'm going to do is just going to make sure i'm on manual transmission on the little mini one
Right, so I think that's as fair as a test as you could possibly ask me to do. So we have got the stock controller, which did, well, 2,000 metres, which incidentally is the, it, it's the furthest I've ever got with the stock controllers in stock form. You know the tests I always do are fair, so it was the same flight environment on the same day, minutes apart, um, same wind conditions, and obviously we were set on a manual 2.4 gigahertz channel. Nothing changed, just drone was landed in between flights, battery changed, back up in the air, nice and simple. So obviously you saw the well, they saw the stock controller top out at 2,000 meters, well 1,900, and then you saw the Pariyagis, and they got us to 5,000 meters before we was battery limited and had to come home. But obviously, as you also saw, so did these new long range Super Yagis, okay? So obviously, Pete's pricing for these are what they are. Um, I will be selling these, and like I say, you can just check them out in the description in the description below um, for details on how to buy them. Um, but yeah, hopefully you found that a very fair test. Um, these were new to me, and they performed perfectly out in the environment. And like I say, no bias towards either. You know, it makes no difference to me which one you buy. Just a little follow-up a follow up video that is coming. So I will be testing Pete's um, 5.8 version of these compared to the 5.8 gigahertz version of these in an urban environment. So that's going to be an interesting video still coming up. Hopefully you enjoyed this uh, video. And like I say, just I just strive on this channel to give you absolutely unbiased buying sort of... Uh, advice and i just put the information out there with fair tests and leave it up to you with the subscriber um, or if you haven't subscribed please consider doing so to decide what you want to do thank you very much for watching hopefully you enjoyed this video and see you on the next one